Okay. Uh, credits to um, uh, to Khan Academy for the material. Let's start with uh, this sheet, which targets uh, the textual evidence questions. Um, textual evidence questions. I need uh, Rashwan. Yalla gama type your answers yes, of yes. the first of the first question, and then we will discuss the answers together. Yes, my friend, start. I did it A. Okay, you did it A. Can you please read and give me an explanation? Okay. In Which, her... Start with the prompt, with the stem of the question at the very beginning. Okay. Which quotation from Spring most effectively illustrates the claim? Okay, so he needs to support the claim or weaken the claim? Support. Yes, support the claim. So the first thing is to get what? Claim. To get the claim. Then we will choose one of the choices that can huh? support the claim. Supported or illust uh, illustrates it or explains it. Okay, what is the claim, please? It's uh, close to the main idea. I know. But Read and tell me where is the claim here or what is the claim here in her 1921 poem? Huh? In her 1921 poem, Spring, Eden Stevens merely subverts a conventional depictions of springtime. Depictions, descriptions of what? Depictions of springtime. Springtime. And instead of? Huh? Instead of celebrating growth and renewal, Melia disputed the merits of the season entirely. Okay, what is the tone? Is it positive or negative? Negative. It's negative. Huh. Since he said, instead of, so there is a contrast. Instead of celebrating, which is positive. So you are sure, you must be sure that after the comma, there will be something negative. Uh, he, this. Disputes disputes. the merit of this uh, season. Okay. Entirely. Refutes or refuses the merit of the season entirely. Okay. Uh, all of them. Okay. What, what are the other answers? A of. Okay. Where, where is the clue, please? In the choice okay. by itself. Huh? To, uh, when it's uh, said that the purpose of the, it return again. It shows the uh, a negative tone toward the season. Uh, I I I know. Do you return again? Uh, okay. W why this is is why this is uh, spring? What's the clue that he is talking about spring in choice A? April is the season where oh, spring. Gets. That's April, which we can match it to spring. And here we have also uh, beauty is not enough. This is a positive tone or a negative one? Negative. So we can match it to what? So, to the refutes. Very dispute. good. Disputes the merit. Thank you so much. Does anyone have a problem with this question? Okay, thank you. Um, Dima. Yes, Mr. Okay, let's move to the next question. What's your answer to this question, please? A. We have A. Okay. What about the rest? Okay. Are there other answers rather than A? Are there? Check, please. Yadima. Are there other answers or the same A? Uh, there is D. There is what? D. Oh, okay. There is D. Let's let's find the differences between A and huh? D. And okay. Huh. Uh, read the prompt. Which finding, if true? Which finding, if true, would most directly support Miller and Harry's conclusion? So what's the first thing we are supposed to do is to find what? The conclusion. 
then we will choose something or one of the choices that will support this conclusion. Okay, the conclusion will be in the text and most properly, uh, probably will be in the last sentence. But we will start reading from the very beginning. Huh. Read. Okay. Many scientists have believed that giraffes are solar characters. Okay. Once you see a gamma have believed or have long believed or have thought, make sure there is a contrast relationship. It's going to compare between uh, something in the past which turns out to be uh, untrue or different. Is it clear? Okay. Okay, so the uh, many scientists have long or have believed that giraffes are what? Huh? Polarity characters. Yes. So but do you think that they are or uh, solitary creatures? Yes. After saying have believed, they have believed in the giraffes are solitary. After the comma, will it be also solitary or something different? Something different. Something different, right? So they thought that they spend their time what? Huh? Alone. Alone. Very good. Can you see? Solitary. Spend time alone. And here there is what? Huh? But observation of giraffes and their behavior at recent. That, that coordinating conjunction shows what relationship? Uh, contrast. Bravo. Contrast relationship. So are, do you expect that they are solitary or the opposite of solitary? Opposite. Very good. Observations of giraffes and their behavior huh, suggested that these animals huh, may be what? Huh? Social. What's the relationship between solitary social. and social? Opposite. Opposite. Okay. And I list the conclusion. I haven't reached the conclusion until now, which is in the last sentence. Huh? Yeah. What's the conclusion? Huh? For example? For example, scientists do Miller. And Tim, Tim uh, Harris claims that giraffes may even help each other care for one another newborn. Giraffes may even help each other care for one another's newborns. So when they help each other, does it mean that they are solitary creatures or social creatures? Social creatures. creatures. Very good. So which means that they are... Huh, this means that they are social creatures, not solitary creatures. What's the difference between A and D? Go to A, please. Read A. Giraffes are... Giraffes are able to make sounds, but are really observed communicating with others. Okay, and D? Uh, it would be wrong because it means solitary and we need to be social. Uh, you are talking about A or D? A first, and uh, then I would say about D. Okay, giraffes are able to make sounds, but are rarely, rarely observe it communicating. Is this like the text or opposite to the text? Opposite. It's opposite to the text. This is wrong. They are social animals. Okay, uh, something um, additionally, huh, make sounds. Is there a clue in the text that they make sounds? No. So the first part we can say this is clueless or it's not supported in the text. And the other one here, this is opposite to the text. So we will go with, huh? D. D. Female giraffes have been observed feeding young giraffes that aren't their direct offspring. So they are helping each other, which means that they are what? Social. Very good. Social. Social creatures, not 
uh, solitary creatures. Very good. Uh, Amr. Uh, Omar Walid. Yes, hello. Hi, Omar. Let's move to the next question, which is three. What's your answer, Omar, to this question? Have you answered it, Omar, or you haven't? Well, I'm going to get it. I'm going to get it. 